Ivermectin is a broad spectrum antiparasitic, and one of the coolest things about it is that you can dose it in several different ways. So it can be used topically, it can be injected, and it can also be given orally. Ivermectin is used to treat roundworms, sequel worms, eye worms, mites, scaly leg mites, and other internal and external parasites in chickens. Usage in poultry veterinarians is common, but not officially approved, so it's considered an off-label medication. It can be given orally, via injection, or via drops on the back of the neck. The dosage depends on the concentration of ivermectin that you're using and the application method. I prefer to use the 1% ivermectin injectable as a topical application. You're far less likely to overdose your bird if you're using a topical application. The only downside to a topical application is that it's a two-person job, so you want to hold your hand very carefully, part the feathers on her neck, and apply the ivermectin to the back of her neck, making sure you get it on her skin. The dosage for 1% ivermectin injectable is 0.4 milligrams per kilogram, or roughly one eye drop per 5 pounds of body weight. The blue ivermectin pour-on is dosed at 0.4 milligrams per kilogram of body weight. It's a little bit harsh for chicken skin, so I try to avoid this one if I can. Ivermectin can also be dosed orally by adding it to their feed, mixing it in with their water, or giving a direct dosage. The oral dose is 0.04 milligrams per kilogram. The oral and intramuscular routes are the easiest ways to overdose your birds. You need to make sure your bird's weight and your math are accurate and use caution. The intramuscular dosage is 0.02 milligrams per kilogram of body weight. Ivermectin must be given twice, 7 to 10 days apart. The second application is to kill any larva that may have hatched after the first application. An egg withdrawal period of seven days following each dose is the standard guideline. To prevent drug-resistant parasites, only treat your flock when they have an active infestation.